Howdy do. I am back here at McClellan Ranch and I am heading over to the labyrinth. It's right next to the parking lot. And I'm going to leave a center stone that I've made. The last time I was here, there was this beautiful labyrinth. Um, I took you through it. We walked together. If you haven't seen that video, check the links in the comments below and you can find it there. But in the center of the labyrinth, there was no kind of offering stone yet. It's a new labyrinth. So I went ahead and found a stone that we can place into the center of the labyrinth um, that will act as kind of an altar, an anchoring stone. And it will also let people know that it's okay to leave things in the middle of the labyrinth. Um, it's, it's encouraged. Let me show you the rock that we're going to place in the middle of the labyrinth. Hey, okay. So, I have a nice rock that I took from the river that's right down below, Stevens Creek actually, and that felt right because it's from the land that's right here. So, I just uh, decorated it a little bit and we'll put this right in the middle of the labyrinth. And this will act as our anchor stone or an altar stone. And I also brought an offering, a personal offering, of some clear quartz. And I'm going to go ahead and leave that in the middle as well. And with time, what we'll probably find is other people will start leaving little bits of offerings, little bits of nature offerings, gifts for Mama Earth. So I'm going to go ahead and walk through the labyrinth and place the stone. And as we do that, let's talk a little bit about manners and etiquette when walking a labyrinth. Although there are not a lot of rules involved with walking a labyrinth, it's, it's really something that you do in your own way. There are some things that you might want to know about so that you can walk with respect. It's customary to enter a labyrinth with an intention and with gratitude. It's customary to also walk with intention, paying attention to our footsteps. It's considered good etiquette to stay on the path and follow that path as it's designed for that labyrinth. When you reach the center of the labyrinth, it's customary to take a moment to leave an offering, to say a prayer, to give some energy to Mama Earth, and to give gratitude. It's also really important to leave everything as is in the center of the labyrinth. Everything that is left as an offering is meant to stay there. Be respectful and walk quietly and don't take any shortcuts and cross over the paths. No, no, no. It's helpful to clear the path of debris as you walk. Make an effort to stay connected with yourself and stay connected with the land. Remember your purpose and your intention for walking. And as you reach the opening of the labyrinth to exit, simply step out and turn around, say a little prayer, say goodbye for now, and it's as easy as that. You can't go wrong if you're respectful and you follow your heart. May you always walk in beauty, my friend. Namaste.